Although it's fast, some local residents say it's not their type of food. It makes me sick to my stomach. I don't like it. I'm really picky about ingredients and I don't want to eat something that I am not certain what's in the, in the product. Grade A ShopRite dietitian Jamie Lee McIntyre says staying away is a good thing. A lot of fast food is completely outside of normal portion control. You usually get served up to two, maybe even three sides the time of one serving. So that's always a constant battle when you're eating out. Portions that are packed with all the wrong ingredients. Most fast food is very high in sugar, sodium, and added fats, um, specifically solid fats and saturated fat. That's the kind of fat that uh, increases risk for heart disease, clogs the arteries. Jamie says it's even important to be aware of healthier menu options. For example, for a lot of the Subway sandwiches under six grams of fat, you have to order it without cheese and without mayo. And that, you know, unless you read the fine print, you don't, you wouldn't really know that. And even beware of the kids menu. A lot of adults should um, be aware of that the calories in a healthy kids meal are pretty much more suitable for an adult, the type of calories an adult should be consuming in one meal. So considering we have an obesity epidemic and childhood obesity is you know, clearly on the rise, knowing that most healthy kids meals contain calories that are suitable for an adult really fits it over in their daily allowance. She says if you do want to grab on the go, get online first and see how many calories and grams of fat there is in that serving. Um, and even if that doesn't cause you to maybe want to eat home and you still want to go out to eat, at least you know that there's really not much room for regular soda, added fries, or anything on the dessert menu.